Communications Many years ago, people used to send messages through pigeons and horse riders. But today, we have different means of communication. We can send messages through letters, telephones, radios, newspapers, etc. There are two types of communication, namely verbal communication and written communication. Verbal communication Verbal communication means sending messages verbally or by talking. Various means used for verbal communication are as follows. Telephone Telephone is an effective and popular means of verbal communication. We can talk to people anywhere in the world on telephone. Now, people also use mobile or cellular phones. These are also called cell phones. Cell phones can be carried with the person everywhere and can be used anytime and anywhere. Radio There are many broadcasting centers of All India Radio. They broadcast news, songs, plays, sports commentary, discussions and many other things. Now, FM programs are also very popular on the radio. Radio is a means of mass communication as large numbers of people are communicated on the radio. Television Television is another effective means of mass communication. It brings everything that radio does, but we can see the events as well. The national television channel of India is called Doordarshan. It reaches maximum people of our country. Various other channels like Aaj Tak, Z News, Star Plus, NDTV India, Sahara News, BBC etc. are also very popular. Written Communication Written communication means sending written messages. There are various means of written communication. Letter Sending or receiving messages through letters is the most common and cheapest means of communication. We can send messages using postcards, inland letters and envelopes. The letter is written along with the address of the receiver and it is posted. This method is not very quick and takes some days to reach the address. Focus India Post has the largest number of post offices in the world. Focus In August 2011, the government of India inaugurated a floating post office in the Dal Lake, Srinagar of Jammu and Kashmir. Short Message Service SMS We use Telegram to send urgent messages in a few words. Mostly, people prefer to use mobile telephones as the telegram service is no longer used in India. It was discontinued on 15th July 2013. The SMS is used both by the government as well as private companies as a means of written communication. Focus Mr. Watson, come here, I want to see you. These were the first words spoken over a telephone. The speaker was Alexander Graham Bell, the inventor of the telephone. Fax machine We can send written messages and pictures through a fax machine. A fax machine prints copies of written messages and pictures sent by another fax machine. The word fax is short term for facsimile. Facsimile means exact copy.